Boys and girls, cats and squirrels, what is going on? My name is Slightly Salt, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke here on the channel. As you can see, I healed, I started healing while I was stopping and restarting the recording for the next episode. But yeah, here we are. We are going to restock on some potions and sell some stuff while we were here as well. We're gonna sell. We're gonna sell a regular repel because we don't need them. We're also gonna sell these seven super repels and pick up some max repels. Red flu we don't need. Water stone we'll keep. X accuracy don't need. Oh, we had two. Sell these yellow flutes. King's rock I'll keep in case we throw it on a guy. The rest of this expedition don't need. We're not gonna use the quick claw. Might as well get rid of it. Um, our piece, all you can do with that is sell it. Calcium, might as well just sell. Now I'm gonna buy some max repels now that we can buy them. Uh, we're gonna buy 15 to last us through all the surfing we're gonna do, all the caves we're gonna do, and yeah. We're also gonna buy some Pokeballs. You know what, let's keep two escape ropes on us, just in case, and let's buy some full heals. And that maxes out what we have in the bank, so now let's, oh wait, we did not check the TMs, did we? We have not checked the TMs in here, let's check them out real quick. I think the next floor is hideout stuff, right? No, it's TMs. Powerful but leaves the user immobile the next turn. That looks like a water type move. So Hydro Cannon. It's a screech to sharply reduce that screech. Those coins payday. Endures attack for two turns to retaliate double. Let's bind. Repeated, repeatedly punches the foe two to five times. Dizzy punch? Pounds the foe with four legs or tail. Don't. Powerful but leaves the mobile, the user immobile the next turn. Not giga impact. It's a fighting type move. Press the enemy with leaves, high critical hit. That's razor leaf. That's a pretty lackluster um, TMs if you ask me. The only one I would really get is Hydro Cannon, but I have Hydro Pump, so it's just not really that worth. Um, but yeah, now we are ready to head on out to the next town and take on the Moz Deep City Gym Leaders, Tate and Lisa. So we're going to try to skip as much as we can here. I think it immediately switches. Oh, it didn't switch routes yet. I think we already encountered something here. I think. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm gonna run from it because it's just Roselia and there's no Rose Raid in this game. So even if it was our encounter, I wouldn't want it. This looks unavoidable, so we're gonna have to battle this one. Oh, one of them. Oh, they're turners. I only have to battle one as long as I move out of the way real quickly. Right after this, Quagsire. Wow, you actually have a water type. Hmm. Interesting. God, stop missing moves. Greedy, come on, you're missing slams left, right, and center. I know it's like, I think it's only 90, it's only like missing 10% accuracy. That's two in a row. What is going on? Yo, graded, we gonna have an issue? Let's not, okay? I swear to God, if we had missed again, I was screaming. Actually rattled from how much we just missed there. I really regret teaching Shellgon Outrage, by the way. I really wish I had a better move on this graded here. Um, I just can't wait to evolve him one day. You know, level 55. He evolves at level 30 and then level 55. Ooh, almost messed up there. Do we need an encounter? 
Let's grab our encounter so then we can just throw up a max repel. You're a dupe squaws. We didn't we start this we started this game with a seal, didn't we? No, we didn't. What is that in that I have a seal right now? I have a seal in a playthrough right now. We have a regular Porygon. Yeah, we're just gonna continue surfing and just encounter as we go. Because we are just getting dupes left, right, and center right now. If it switches routes, then I'll come back. A Trico. We ended up not catching the Girl Vow, so I'm okay with this. I would actually really like to level you up and get you this team. Or Slam could just Oko you. That's okay. I didn't want you anyway. Not like I really wanted a Trico on this team. We finally got our second chance at a Trico and we killed it. Maw's Deep City. Here we are. Actually, we have a Maw's Deep encounter that we can grab too. Oh, what are you teaching any what are you teaching us now? Oh, flame wheel? Okay. That's right. Flame wheel we had on we had Flame Wheel on uh, Typhlosion, but we didn't have it on our guy Tor uh, Torch Steer. Okay, I thought he teach something too. Okay, let's grab our encounter before we take on the gym. We can grab a Maz Deep City encounter. Who's it gonna be? It's oh! I am not opposed to a brain room. Not opposed at all. Oh, it's one thing I've even been considering. I'm like, yo, I would really like to get. Actually, I might have just killed it. Oh no! Thank God. Oh, stuns for us, eh? Well, I'm gonna thunder wave you. Uh, T wave. One thing I was really, um, you have limber. Okay. All I can do now is throw balls at you. <laughs> uh, one thing I was really wanting on the team was a fighting type. I was actually contemplating, I was like, you know what? If I don't get our solid sixth member before the Elite Four, when we get to the Elite Four, um, before we actually go into the Elite Four, I was going to delete all the HMs off of Med M Medicham and I teach it some new moves and bring it in with me. Okay, Shroomish has Limber. Uh, it's a sh mushroom. We are gonna name him um, Mushed. We're gonna name him Mushed. It was either Mushed or Shroomed. I kind of like Mushed. All right. But I was like, yeah. And I really wanted a fighting type. And then I also really wanted Trico for a grass type, which we also don't have. And we just got two and one. So that's pretty cool, and I'm really down to use them. I'm really down to use Shroomish. Not right now, because uh, we're about to take on a gym, and I don't want to add him to the team right before gym. But definitely, maybe in between episodes or before the Elite Four. Yeah, I'll take you guys on one on one. Might be easier that way. And again, it takes more time to take you guys on one-on-one. -on -one. Lunatone. Wow. A Pokemon that the gym leader is supposed to have, but he's not going to have. I'm also just getting really tired of trading up uh, Dragonair. Not going to lie, because Dragonair is not that great. No, honestly, Dragonite. Pretty decent. Dragonair, not that great. Cosmic power, you raise your defense. Raise your special defense. So yeah, we're just gonna continue going for Dragon Rage because it's base damage. Rock throw. Thank God we are not a Dragonite yet, apparently. Why couldn't Dra Dragonair evolve at like 45? That'd be so much nicer. Why didn't I put on Easy Evolution? Did I put on Easy Evolution? I don't think I did. I hope not, because then I just kind of like messed up a little bit. I am here and I am ready to go and do the ting. I gotta do the ting. 
and then do the other thing and do this thing that thing all the things because right now i'm coming this way because i have to go and move stuff around so we can actually do some stuff um amber and flame meal flame meal on him no way raf rig is wonder yard could be problematic. Okay. You're going to use you wave on him and you're gonna use bite. I haven't even been thinking about Wonder Guard. Oh yeah, I didn't think about safeguard, eh? Okay, so now just use slam and um hope he doesn't go for a counter on you. He just went for a mirror coat, so hopefully it doesn't go for counter. He graded up to level 40, so that means I could use... And he also... Oh, he used counter this time. Okay. Um, mm, slam and bite. Somebody's dying. Oh, no. Thank God we're both faster. Oh, my God. I panicked a little there. I definitely panicked a little. Oh, I'm only 10 minutes into the recording. If we're done this by 20, then we could definitely get this from Topless and at least hit the Pokemon Center there. Um, that's one thing for sure that we can do. Um, yeah. And then we can... Maybe start hitting up the uh, cave that we got left. There's a cave to do. That is a thing that we gotta do. We have the um, we have the underground cave, right? We go get Kai Ogre. Yeah, we got Kai Ogre's cave to do still. And then we're gonna have to go and get uh, Rayquaza. I don't actually think I'm gonna do. Uh, the tower to go and catch the legendary Rayquaza. I just I don't want to spend the time going to catch him. I've also never actually done his tower properly. It was my first time doing Mirage Tower because of the bike stuff. I really don't want to waste time doing the whole tower and stuff. Um, and yeah, so I think I'm just going to skip that tower. Not going to lie. Like how we're gonna skip some of the trainers. You're gonna have to do this one. Oh no, not you're gonna have to battle you though. But that's okay. I don't mind. Um, let's see. You got a gold bat. That's all right. You kind of, I kind of just blanked out there. Yeah, but I don't think we're gonna do the um, uh, Rayquaza. Power. I don't think it's worth it. Mm -mm. attack, seriously? You're gonna do me like that, Golbot? Thought we were friends. Kill, kill, kill. Beautiful. By the way, if I do need like multiple Sacmons, like my first Sacmon's obviously gonna be Medi Medicham, but if I need a multiple, uh, a second one, uh, I honestly think right now that my second Akmon will be uh, Dragonair, as much as it pains me to say it. Um, just because of the whole training up to get a Dragonite thing is not appealing to me right now. Oh, why could it hit the red switch more times and had it come back? I just realized that. Oh well. That's okay. Oh no, I couldn't because I needed the red switch like this for the other side. Yeah, that is a thing. Yeah, I need it like that so I can do this and come right up here. And then just go like this and boom, in their time. Boys, girls, cats, and squirrels, are you ready? 
four. One of the last gym leaders, the second to last gym leader here in the Hoenn region, Tate and Lisa. Oh my god, we are almost at the end of our first ever series here on the channel. Get some hype in the comment section if you are excited for the finale coming soon in just a few short episodes. It's coming. Also, you know what the question of the day is going to be today? The question of the day is... Do you guys think we are going to win this Let's Play? I want to know, uh, not even this Let's Play, this Nuzlocke, it's just a basic Nuzlocke. Do you guys think we're going to win our technically first ever Nuzlocke year on the channel? I want to know what you guys think. This is scary, they actually have a psychic type and it's why not. Somebody's dying here. Oh, somebody's dying here. Because we used a physical and a special move. Should have left why not on its own. I should have left it on its own, and I should have parried it right off the bat. Or I should have left it on its own and swapped out graded for slacked. The slacked and flaring on together would have for sure okoed this thing. Slacked almost just okoed it by himself. That was my stupidity, boys. Uh, that was my stupidity. So yeah, question of the day. Will we win this Nuzlocke? Alright, they got basic stuff. I should have forced... I think I thought I did force fully evolved Pokemon. After like... Maybe it was after level 50 I forced it. I thought I did. For our next ROM... For our next uh, emulator, uh, we are definitely going to force fully evolved evolutions at a certain point. That's for sure. Uh, but other than this Ho-Oh, this gym was pretty lackluster. Well, then again, it still killed our Pokemon. One of my favorites um, on the team. I was a big fan. I'm, I was just a big... I always find you need a fire type on a playthrough. Uh, to, um, like, you need, like, fire types are just so useful. I feel like you always need a fire type on your team if you want to win the playthrough. Um, but yeah. Oh my god, he has recover. I think I'm gonna pair him. I think that's gonna be the play. You know, if, uh, oh, I went for Twister instead. That was a mistake. I, I'm just... I'm half to let Graded die. If he, if he gets Graded here, so be it. Because I want him to... That might be enough. Not at all. I was going to say that might be enough to do enough to put him in range for Slash to kill, but it doesn't. I'm crit him. I'm so done with graded. Even if you had crit him, you wouldn't kill him. Oh my god. Get your T wave. Thank the absolute lord, because graded is getting on my nerves. We're gonna try attack him because we're not getting the crit that I want. Um and yeah. And I really don't feel like swapping out Graded. Do I have another Pokemon, another fire type in the box? Because Torkoal's just not the greatest fire type. <laughs> um, like I'll bring him on the team, but at the same time I'm like, mm, do I really want him? I should be using Dragon Rage on him. That was partially my mistake. I should have been using Dragon Rage. Bubble Beam. How much is Bubble Beam doing? Not much. 
No, it's nothing. My attack. Now we get a crit. Do you know how many times... How many times has Slam missed... Somebody calculate, please, how many times Slam has missed for me. And let me know. Because we should have been long done this battle. Being slapped to use tri attack is so weird because tri attack is a, is a special move, and slacking doesn't usually use special moves because he's a physical hitter, not a special. But in this generation, there's uh, the physical. There is no physical special split. All normal type moves are physical. Oh, he uses tri attack. In randomizers because he doesn't learn it in a regular playthrough I don't think I don't think at least and that's it for the seventh gym we've done the seventh gym now we can start heading to pseudo pseudopolis or whatever it is oh no we gotta go do the stuff at the um at the laboratory take this to tm04 what's tm04 What dance? They say lunar dance? Lunar dance isn't in this game. They gave me another TM for swords dance. I did not need another swords dance. It's not what I needed whatsoever. Oh yeah, and we can't even skip this because um... This is where Steven gives us dive. After this is where he gives us dive, and you need that. We are going to go and box Larion. And uh, for now, I'm just going to add a second um, HM slave to the team. So we're going to have to use dive shortly. And I don't want to waste it on anyone. So, who is going to be. We're just going to bring Paul Coded back on the team for dive. <sighs> Move items. We are going to put uh, you two in the front. I want him to be our highest level. Actually. No, I'm gonna put Gyarados in the front. Item take. Item give. Give him the lucky egg. Alright. We are now off. Everybody's healed, right? Yeah, we're good. We are now off to go battle this. Um, to go battle Team Magma at this laboratory. I'm gonna leave Scott there. I don't think he gives us anything. Even if he does, it's nothing important. Alright, battle me. Space Center. Yeah, this is the Space Center rep, NASA. I forgot, that's what Sotopolis is all about, Tate and Lisa, that's why they're psychic types. And they have like space Pokemon is because it's space stations on this place. I think their parents actually work for the space station if I'm not mistaken. They were, it, their like father or mother was a gym leader. And then they like went on a, I think the lore behind it is like they went on a um, space excursion. So while they're on their space excursion, Tate and Lisa are running the gym. I would love to see like a prequel to like the current Owen that we've seen where like we have a young Watson gym leader and like we have Flannery's grandfather um and it's like the it's about the OG fight between like the three legends like I want to see more land and less water and we find out like there was a huge fight between the two that created like all the water and like the land and like the big difference between land and water. I would love to see that. 
like there's there was more water spaced out across the land and stuff but then because of the fight it became like very half and half like it's all like if you look at Hoenn map half of it is all land and half of it is all water it'd be pretty cool to see like there was a fight between the two and that's how it all broke out beforehand there was a lot more land and water So like, and that could be like the perfect way to introduce other gems like Roxanne. Roxanne's rock type gem. He's really young, so that would be like a really young gem. We should totally make like a series on the channel of like new Pokemon stories. Like either sequel, like kind of like what Black and White, then Black and White Two did. Black and White Two was two years later, if I'm not mistaken, after Black and White. So we'll do like two years before Hoenn, but it wouldn't. It would be like. 20 years before or something. Not 20, like 50. 40. 40. Watson is like 60. We'll bring in like a... 20 year old Watson. It's when Watson first became the gym leader and stuff. That would be really cool, I think. It'd be a pretty cool series. One day I do want to do a series where it's like... Me and my subscribers, I would have to have a lot more subscribers and viewers for this, but like we make our own region. I think that would be pretty cool. Wow, we are already at 25 minutes. Come on, let's finish up the space station. Let's at least finish up the space station so we can start heading to Sotopolis. But yeah, so I think that could be a pretty cool mini series is that we take we take a deeper look into each region. Or like each region could be like a three part series or something where like I talk we spend one episode talking about the story and stuff and another episode talking about like the gyms and like what order you would do them in in the game like what would be your starting area and stuff and like I play around with the map and add more to the map and stuff It'd be sick I like this idea we're gonna do that I'm gonna do that one day Maybe when I start my, um, when my semester ends, maybe that's going to be my project during, uh, during, um, my winter, my winter break is going to be this project of at least Hoenn. We're going to do Hoenn at least, however many parts it takes us, where we talk about, like, the lore and stuff of, like, our new region. And maybe, like, even get, like, a rough sketch of, like, what our new trainers would look like or something. That could be so cool. Oh, jeez. Oh. Uh, we're faster, so we're good. I'm just gonna have to heal after this battle. And like before this war, Armaldo and stuff, Armaldo and Cradley were, this was the war that got rid of them and stuff. That'd be a little weird, but yeah, maybe there was other Pokemon though that did used to roam this nation and because of this war, they left type of thing. Hmm, interesting. This could be an interesting kind of, uh, story. This would be an interesting series to do. Enter. Oh, we're not entering you. Enter and enter. I want to make sure we win this and don't lose anyone. So I'm definitely not bringing Dragonair. The tank, Skarmory, and Aggron, his team doesn't really change. Oh, but I'm kind of pumped about this now, too. Pumped about doing a series where, like, we take older regions and older stories, like the Hoenn region, and make it, like, our own region with a new story and stuff. Oh, that would be so sick. Um, I don't like this matchup. I don't like it whatsoever. Uh, even, because Magnemite's level 42. Uh, so, and we are four times... Uh, he's four times super effective against Gyarados, so not a fan. Really? T-Wave on me? Uh, we are gonna slash Sylvie. 
Now you get the light screen up. Way to go, Matang. Magnum. <laughs> Celebi has Wonder Guard. Well, that's not good. I want a Celebi. I want Wonder Guard Celebi. Okay, well, we're gonna have to get Magnemite out then for sure. He's the only one that has a super effective move on my team right now on Celebi would be my Gyarados. Who is. would. Um, would get killed by Magnemite. Which I don't want happening. So let's just keep killing whoever's on the right side, and then we could bring in Eridos. Yeah, we're only going to be heading to Cetopolis in the next episode for sure. Um. Alright, they sent out a snubble. Go for that try again. Again. Try attack event. I said try again, again. Um. Ooh. Ooh, doing damage, doing damage. Hey, see? Alright, paralyzed. Uh, we're gonna go for slash on you this time. So it looks like Wednesday's episode is going to be taken on the cave. I think we're, what we're going to do is Wednesday we're going to take on the cave and um, hmm. Wednesday's episode is going to have to take on the cave and uh, and so topless gym, which I think we can do. We may have to push it up to like a 40 minute episode, but like, I think we can do it. And then only on, and then on Thursday, we are going to have like, either Thursday, we're going to have like an extremely long episode or Thursday, Friday is going to be two episodes. Like I'm going to do, um, an episode on Thursday of like definitely like um actually you know what we're just gonna swap out the Gyarados right now definitely gonna do like an episode on Thursday of like me doing the cave and then maybe we'll have two episodes going up on Friday one of Sword and Shield and then one and then the finale of Pokemon Emerald 2 uh maybe we'll have two episodes going up on Friday so we can get this done for Friday Hmm. I think it's possible. Uh, and we just have a finale on the launch date of Sword and Shield, which I don't want to do, but I think well, we're going to have to do it. Uh, I think that's the only way. That will take a future side attack. Okay. Yeah, that's going to do nothing. Can we keep flinching Celebi? That would be awesome. Come on, Matang. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. Oh well, we killed Marilyn, that's okay. I thought Celipi was the one at 38. Don't get a stat buff, don't get a stat buff. You do not have Metal Claw, you have Metal Claw. Steel is, isn't Steel super effective against grass? Isn't that a thing? Scream, of course. If you're going to use a screen, use Reflect. Alright, one more hit, one more hit. And then we're going to get Dive, and we are going to call it an episode. Oh, jeez, no, we still have two more to take on. Oh my god. Now you go for Metal Claw. Are you kidding me? Surf. Surf should still do damage. Wow, not as much as I thought it would. 
Alright, Psychic. Good kill. No. Oh, a special defense dropped. Surf might be able to kill him now. Yep, Surf kills. Who's next? Send in a poison type so I'm gonna tank and kill him with uh psychic. Hey. Wow. Asking you shall receive apparently. Alright. Well that's it for the battle. Now we just gotta get through some dialogue and all is good. We might have like three episodes going up on Friday, because honestly I might do two sword and shield episodes. I don't know yet. I haven't decided. Me recording Sword and Shield is going to go by really quickly because I'm going to be recording it like every day because I'm going to want to get through the game as fast as possible. Because I love grinding out games like when they come out. Like I love, especially like uh, Pokemon games. Like Ultra Sun and Moon and Sun and Moon. I finished, they came out on the Friday. I finished by Saturday. I think they both came out on Fridays. But like that's what happened the day they came out i finished it the next day i was like on it i was like no chance i'm waiting for this we got dive now we are gonna go heal so we are ready to start the next episode just going to topless city but either way guys um i hope you guys are enjoying I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to be doing with this series. Um, yeah, like, how am I going to finish it and stuff? It's all going to be figured out soon. Maybe, like, maybe I'll just end up having two episodes Thursday or something like that. So we ended off on Thursday, and I don't have one two-hour episode. I have, like, two half-an-hour episodes, or maybe, like, I do... Two, if I have if I have like another half hour episode I do like two on Wednesday then two on Thursday or something like that who knows what's gonna happen just I can guarantee you you are gonna have daily content for like all week actually why am I saying this now I'm saying this now because I'm recording this realizing that I have daily content now for the rest of the week and um but you're only seeing this after I put out all the daily content pretty much but either way guys I hope you did enjoy if you did enjoy please hit that like button uh subscribe if you are new to stay up to date on whenever i post uh there's a playlist coming up like in five seconds there's gonna be a playlist that pops up on the screen click on it if you want to watch the other episodes in case you haven't answered the question of the day do you think we will win this series uh because we could still lose in like the next episode and then i don't have to worry about the rest of the series until sword and shield and yeah and if this isn't daily then that's probably why it's because we did lose so yeah um, either way, guys, I hope you did enjoy, and I will catch you in the next one. Stay salty.